Hey everyone, it's Melinda Kim from Aspirely TV, and today I look like I have no hair, but I really do. I swear I looked a lot cuter in the bathroom, but okay, well this is going to be the best it's going to get today. It's no deal. So while I was getting ready, I heard the news that Julie Chen announced she had eye surgery early in her career to enlarge her eyes because somebody actually told her that her ethnicity or her culture was hindering her career. And I found that so sad and I'm so glad that she brought it up because this whole eye thing is a huge thing with Asians and I didn't know that. I know, me being Asian, I did not know that Asians enlarge their eye, they cut a slit so they have like this double fold thing going on. They do all kinds of plastic surgery to look more westernized. And honestly, I thought that Asian was the next hot thing. I don't know, I'm hearing a lot of guys like Asian girls. So guys like Asian girls with plastic surgery looks like western people? Hmm. Go work out, go and go to the spa, go get your hair done. Uh, there's so many things we can do to make the best of what we have and who we are. So please don't feel like you need to look like you're from another culture or to hide your own culture, I guess would be a better um, word for it, to enhance either your career or personal goals. I just don't, I don't feel like you need to do that nowadays. I know that racism is still obviously very prevalent today and I'm not ignorant to that. I do feel like we need to stand strong and to, to, to stand in our own culture and let our own beauty shine. So here's another thought. Isn't being pretty being like asymmetric? So like as long as you match from one side to another, aren't you pretty? So happy Thursday and I will see you next time. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe.